military shows captured Russian hardware outside Kharkiv. On the road outside Kiev, between Kharkiv and Chuiv, Ukrainian forces captured Russian military hardware. Along the road, there were burnt and damaged civilian cars and bodies laying on the ground, footage too gruesome for the sun to show. Ukrainian forces on site said they would try and repair the Russian tanks in order for their army to use them. Meanwhile U.S. troops in Poland are providing some training on weapons sent to Ukraine. U.S. troops in Poland have been providing Ukrainians with some instruction on how to use weapons and equipment that the West has been shipping into Ukraine, sources familiar with the matter tell CNN, as part of the United States' efforts to help Ukrainian forces repel Russian attacks. U.S. President Joe Biden said on Monday that those American forces have been helping train the Ukrainian troops in Poland. The troops have been deployed there to help bolster NATO's eastern flank during Russia's invasion of Ukraine. While in Poland last week, Biden heard directly from the troops about how they were providing the tactical weapons training to the Ukrainians there, the sources said. We were talking about helping train the Ukrainian troops that are in Poland, Biden said on Monday. He was seeking to clarify a remark he made last week to U.S. troops that they would be seeing when you're there, women, young people, standing in the middle of the damn tank, saying I'm not leaving. I'm holding my ground.